Hello friends, welcome. We have a question here. 8 raised to the power x equals to x raised to the power 6. So for us to solve this, we can multiply both sides by 1 over x. So we're going to have 8 raised to the power x times 1 over x here will be equals to x raised to the power 6 times 1 over x. So we can have this. 8 raised to the power x over x equals to x raised to the power 6 raised to the power 1 over x. So we're going to have 8 equals to x raised to the power 6 raised to the power 1 over x. Recall that that a raised to the power m raised to the power n is the same thing as a raised to the power n raised to the power m. So we're going to write here. We can write this as 8 equals to x raised to the power, bring this, 1 over x raised to the power 6. So Meaning, we can also write this as 8 raised to the power, removing this, 1 over 6 equals to x raised to the power 1 over x raised to the power 6, 1 over 6. So, what are we going to have here? 8 raised to the power 1 over 6. Will be equals to x raised to the power 1 over x. This 6 times 1, 6 divided by 6 is 1. That is what we have. So, that is what we have now. So, we can write this as 2 raised to the power 3 is 8, then raised to the power 1 over 6 equals to x raised to power 1 over x. So, 2 raised to power 3 times 1, 3 over 6, equals x raised to power 1 over x. So, we can write this as 2 raised to power 1 over 2 equals x raised to the power 1 over x. So if we compare it now, we we'll compare this numerator to numerator and powers to powers, we can say that x equals to 2. x equals to 2. So let's check if our answer is correct. Check. In our checking, remember that the original equation was original equation was 8 raised to the power x equals x raised to the power 6. So 8 raised to the power x is 2. Will it give us 2 raised to the power 6? 8 raised to the power x is 8. 8 raised to the power 2 is 8 times 8. 2 raised to the power 6 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. So 8 times 8, 64. And, and 2 times 2 times 2 is 64. So left hand side, hand side equals right hand side. So the equation is correct. X equals to 2. Thank you for watching and do remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye-bye.